What's up guys, it's Jordan here, and today I have not a Call of Duty Black Ops gameplay for you guys. I have a Modern Warfare 3 gameplay. I know I did say in my last video that I will be giving you guys a call, a search and destroy um, on Black Ops, but unfortunately I had some render error problems and um, the render failed about 2-3 times, so you know, I had this video, I had already edited with um the color correction and everything so i decided you know why not just you know i'll just use this video and add a commentary to it so this video is a how to earn a moab on c town and in my opinion c town is the easiest map to earn a moab at, moab on even though you know it'll be between either c town and dome you know either one of these maps. Now the first thing you want to do, as you can see, I'm rocking a portable radar and my favorite gun and favorite specialist perks. That is a good spot to put your portable radar. Now the reason behind that is if you and your teammate can capture C and capture B and hold on, hold down those two flags for the remainder of the game, the enemy is going to be forced to spawn at A and the only way they can actually get to C is if they run to the far outside in the opening where which is by B as soon as you run past those chickens and go straight ahead into that building that's the only way they can actually get towards C where I'm pretty sure if you have a good stable team your teammates won't allow them to make you no know, cross that boundary so you they'll be just right there between A where the chickens are and in this big circular dome over there where your portable radar is beneath it the reason for it being beneath it is because I don't know if this is a spawn error or a glitch, but whenever it's like at a certain time or period in the game, whenever you have C and B and you just constantly kill the team, their whole team is just going to start spawning in that building. And that gives you like a lot of kills. That lets you earn a bunch of kills. Now, that does happen to me in this game, so you're going to have to just wait and see what happens. And then another tip, when it comes towards that time, I'll tell you guys what to do. Another thing that I want to tell you guys to do is stick to the outskirts of this map, which is where that you see I'm running by. I'm running from C straight towards looking at A. I have an open access looking at B. I don't want to run all the way over in the middle, you know, go all the way in that building that's right above B. I don't want to go over there. I don't want to cross that border. I just want to stay over here by this truck looking at A, running back and forth to C with my specialist and looking straight at B and picking up people like I am right now and that's all you need to do <clears throat> you know you can go upstairs a couple of times look over but don't try to stay up here too much because you will have a wonder you know guys on the other team camping in the building right above B and that's just gonna you're just gonna get picked off through that window or someone's just gonna come up behind you and knife you but a thing that I can tell you to help you prevent from being killed in the building right there that I previously came out of before I say that this is what I'm talking about this is where their whole team just spawned in this circular dome. And what, when you see this, don't stay in one spot and continue to shoot. Go from side to side. Go from left to right. And then, when things get all too hectic and you start throwing grenades and your screen gets all red, run away. Don't stay there and fight. Just run away. You know, do that and you will stay alive. Now, back to what I was saying. And the thing to help you not get killed in that building is if you have a really good headset. Like me, I run the Astro A40s. And it's e very easy for me to sound whore. There are a bunch of things that you can do with this headset. This headset is perfect for everything. Like right now, um, I'm not using my my regular mic to do my commentary. I am using this because I am using my laptop to record my commentary. So I am <clears throat> using my Astro A40s to do this commentary. So if the, the voice quality is very good on it. So... You know, get a really good headset. I will recommend, if you guys are on the PlayStation 3 like I am, you guys can use a Samsung wireless stereo headset mic. If you guys are on the PlayStation 3, um, I'm not really sure which Turtle Beaches they are, but I know, just don't get the PX20 ones, because the PX20 ones are just the worst headsets ever. And, as you can see right now, I got stuck in this area, so what I'm doing is, I'm looking from left to right, and... I'm just, you know, picking up enemies, and as you can see right there, I pick up the Moab, and as soon as I call it, I end up dying. And you see where I just respawned? Don't ever come to this spot where you're on your Moab streak. Stay to the outskirts over there by C, where you can run back from C and back to A. Stay over there in the outskirts where you can pick up easy kills, 
and if your enemy if your teammates like I said is stable they'll be able to keep the boundary from letting them go from C and this is when you know after I decided you know, I got my Moab now I gotta help my teammates win this game unfortunately we did lose by one point the score was 200 to 199 I don't know how we lost but you know it's like as we captured one flag they captured the next one as we captured this flag they captured the next one it's like they had a guy just sitting at the flag for like okay let's wait until they captured then I'll jump on it but as soon as we got we triple capped them and then we came up in the lead it was tied game then we had two flags they had one then you know coming towards the end they just started triple capping us and that's when it all goes down for us so if you guys just follow those tips use whatever gun you like it doesn't really matter some machine any gun assault rifle anything is is really good just don't try to go you know all out and be like oh this is gonna be real easy and start using a sniper unless you know all your shots are pinpoint 100 percent accurate you know you can use whatever gun you want whatever suits you and i do recommend you run the portable radar so you can put it in that spot like what i showed you because that spot is going to help you know whenever the enemy is spawning in that, in that area and they won't just run straight down the stairs and catch you off running towards C. Now those tips are really good. You know if you have a good headset put it to the use and peace out. Securing Charlie. Suck it up, focus on the next battle.